morning everyone happy monday i feel like i'm a cat lady with all of the dogs that are in my car at all times it is monday morning i stayed at my parents last night so i'm driving back into the city so it's like a 40-ish minute drive and i'm at my favorite starbucks drive through the adriatica drive through um it's the best one this is like the one that I like grew up at the most. Anyways, my window is like so dirty. Oh my gosh, it's embarrassing. I need to get a car wash, but it's like all trees, so cute. There's water over there, beautiful homes. I'm trying out a different order. I saw it on Instagram. Hi, how are you? Can I just have a grande iced chai with one shot of espresso and then the pumpkin cream cold foam, please? Oh, no problem. Perfect, thank you. Guys, I'm gonna have a secret roommate, hopefully in November. Comment down below if you guys can guess who it is. <gasps> Ooh! I'm gonna listen to a podcast, I'll let you guys know. I'm wearing another boy's life set. This one's my favorite, word vomit. Um, I'll see if I can link it below because this one is actually, has been available more than my other ones. Guys, I've just been loving the constant uploads, the vlogs, everything, it's been so fun. Coco, I swear, girl, stay over there. I need like limo blockers for these dogs, okay? That's what I need. That is a second little white tiny dog I've seen yeah. in like the last three minutes. Aww. So cute. <gasps> Thank you. Thank you. Oh my gosh, fix? Yes. I'm surprised that you knew that. I feel like he doesn't like a normal doodle at all. Yeah, I've seen a lot of them that have like thank you. Hair. Yeah, he. Oh my gosh, Fitz. Oh my gosh, thank you. Have a good day. No puppuccinos for you guys today because you guys have not been good. Taste test, everyone. This, here's the order. Screenshot if you want. It's very good. It's not something I get regularly. I have to be in the mood for a sugary drink, and most of the time that just make me fall asleep. Here's what you should do. You should just keep your schedule clear in hopes of me being but like, hey. When you ask me to hang out, it's like in the world. <laughs> Alright, well, I'll see you at 345 on the dot. Oh, my God. What? I mean, it's 40 minutes away. A lash lift shouldn't take a full hour. But I'm going to go get waxed. I'll see you later. Alright, well, I'll remember this. I really will. All right, guys, I'm back home. I was just cleaning up a little bit, but I wanted to show you guys a few things that I've recently picked up. First thing, film. Not exciting. Um, oh, I got those light bulbs that change colors because everyone like keeps talking about them on Instagram. So I got these new collars and leashes from Amazon because rope collars like this or leashes like this cost a lot of money. These definitely don't feel as nice, but they are pretty similar. However, these were only like $10 and normally they're like 40. So I will link them down below, but I got this collar it's way too big for him, so I might just order a small one for the time being. And then Coco's came in. You guys are on her, um, I don't even know if this is going to fit. Honestly, you're on the leash right now, so I can't show you, but it's that in a beige color. Like, oh no, this is definitely going to fit her. Okay, so this is really cute. Honestly, guys, like, this is so inexpensive too. Bonza sent me stuff, so we've got some rotini pasta under you guys. It's a tripod, um, shells. Some vegan mac and cheese, which I might make today. And then we've got some bonza rice made from chickpeas, and I love chickpeas. The next thing I have is a selfie stick. I bought one of these months ago, and like I swear it just completely disappeared. I don't know what happened to it. I need one for the house because like obviously I don't have people. I work by myself, so I don't have like people to take photos of me today. Oh, slash I like hate asking people to take photos of me. There's like a select few group of people that I will actually ask and they all have nine to five jobs so I don't see them during the day. I will be setting this up, I'm excited. I bought one because it broke forever ago and it literally just disappeared, like that's not okay. So this is I'm assuming how you hold the phone in. This goes, I'll figure it out. I have another thing from Maritzia. Ooh, I made one order but it comes separately. One of them was on back order. So, this looks more blue than gray, doesn't it? I mean, I like it, but I got it to match my pants. The big one, so this is gonna be like super slouchy. However, I don't know. I love the TNA boyfriend fit. I always get a size three because in my mind, that's like the, that's like the biggest one. I want to oversize. This is the oversized crew, oversized. Um, and I still get the biggest size that there is. I'm literally gonna look like a marshmallow or something. I'm gonna use this to throw the trash away. 
so resourceful, you know? I don't know where my chapstick is, but I'll put on lip gloss. All right, I need to finish putting stuff away. Getting that organized, I think I'm gonna go upstairs and sweep off my rooftop. I haven't been up there in like probably two months because it's been so hot, but it's getting nice now. And yesterday I ordered online a fire pit and chair set, which I'm really excited for. So we're gonna make the rooftop fall. So get pumped, everyone. Wow, just dear God, guys. The umbrellas over there, all of these, like, this is not, yeah, it could be better. I hate these umbrellas. Gotta go. I think this will be the corner where the fire pit stuff goes. We'll see. Obviously, the pool's gotta go. Ooh, this rug is like ruined. Oh, shoot. died but a little update guys right in this corner is gonna be the fire pit over here I'm still I literally have this turf downstairs and I've not yet to bring it up haven't gotten around to it so should I put turf around here and make it like a little dog park type thing I know it could smell so I don't know I need to clean the floors again like my mom and I did this summer it was really a lot that is gonna stay um, even though obviously we won't be like laying out and then this rug is trash. Like it's so gross now because of all the rain and everything. So I need to find a better outdoor rug that doesn't shed because as you can see, it gets on this. I mean, it comes off, but it gets all over my couch. I still need to get pillows for outside. I love this set still. I'll have it linked down below. I have no idea what that is. So that worries me. Um, and then yeah, over here will be the little fire pit area. It's gonna be really cute. I might move the umbrellas for the time being. I'm not sure. Woo! This lens is not okay. Okay guys, sorry it is so much later. My camera died so I wasn't able to vlog this morning but I just got a lot of cleaning done. I put away like three loads of laundry. What's new with me and laundry guys? I know. Um, I just got a lot of stuff done around the house and I feel good. I self tan. I forgot to mention tonight um, is very exciting. We are actually shooting um, a new cover for my podcast which I've been wanting to do for so long but we had to like rent a convertible which sounds so douchey but <laughs> when you guys see the photo it won't be or at least hopefully it won't be it's really just like you guys will see okay the brights oh my sister's doing my hair and makeup so you guys will see that in the vlog but on the bright side it is officially fall it feels like fall the rooftop feels so good i mean it just feels so good out and i'm just in the best mood which inspired me to get back to cooking i feel like i've taken the last few weeks off i've been ordering way too much doordash and that just cannot happen anymore so we are going to trader joe's which i haven't been to in a few weeks i've just been ordering stuff and i have a stew and a soup that i'm going to be making there's this pasta i want to make but i don't think i'm going to get the ingredients just yet because i don't want to get them and then them go bad and it just be like too much food at my house so we'll see this feels like such a good thing because who remembers when i used to always sit here and then put my airpods in before i would go on trader joe's of course all these people park near me as i'm talking to a camera this case is from cover lab by the way i actually have another one i need to try putting my airpods in probably gonna listen to a podcast but i'll show you guys what list i made um, like I said, there's one recipe I don't think I'm gonna buy right now, but I will do that later this week if I end up making it. I'm just not sure what the week entails, okay? So I make like my menu for the week. It's really easy. I pretty much always choose from the modern proper. Any of my recipes are from them. They're not my recipes, but anything I make is from them basically. Nine times out of ten, I would say. I think this is gonna be purchased later. I'm gonna get these two things today. The lentil soup with quinoa and mushrooms, and then I'm gonna make a spiced vegetable soup or stew. I don't know why I cannot read breakfast and then I need to get something for snacks, but I always have the link here so it's easy to go back to and then I can check it all off. It's really simple. Here is my grocery haul for the week. I just did it on story, so apologies if you guys are saying it twice, but vegetable broth, onions, eggs, banana, celery, carrot, avocado, quinoa, seasonings, my favorite um, for avocado toast, 
Then I just got a bunch of, you guys can see it here. It's all pretty much the same stuff. Kale, um, mushrooms, some flowers. I'm gonna make some fall arrangements. We'll see, because I actually, there wasn't a lot to pick from that was like more fall. And also this eucalyptus is actually just from my shower. I've been wanting to try that for so long and I just am now getting, it literally has been like three years. Um, diced tomatoes. This is actually my favorite bread. They're gluten-free bread. It's definitely a little more expensive, but it's so good, especially with avocado toast. Sweet potatoes, lemons, garlic, um, ginger, uh, lentils. These are for uh, the soup that I'm making. This is like my favorite thing from Trader Joe's, the glaze. It's so bomb. Oh my gosh. And then organic tahini, which I used to have on salmon all the time, but I just haven't found it. It hasn't been at my Trader Joe's since I moved and it was there today. So really just made me so happy. So good about this like who would have thought that I could make something like this oh my gosh I am just so pleased with myself I don't even know I mean the tall one goes on the table but it just looks so cute I guess that will go on the coffee table wow I'm just so impressed <laughs> I was worried about with my sister moving 10 minutes away from me. She's just shown up. Yeah, wow, so you can like walk. Her femur is broken, by the way, guys. So how's it going? Oh, it's 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 fits. It's, no, you can't take that from. No. You are literally so annoying. Maddie, that's literally my water bottle. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you are actually being so annoying. She just comes over here. Buddy, I was literally just about to edit. Come here. Oh, he's so big. Oh my gosh, what if this doesn't what? want that? Oh, that's actually oh, that's actually really cute, I'm not gonna lie. Wow. Maddie's doing my hair while I edit. It's really great. She looks so happy too. supposed to go shoot my new podcast cover art in like two or three hours but now it is a 90% chance of rain and it's outside and it involves a car dealership so I just like feel bad because there's so many people who are involved but obviously I like, can't control this but it still sucks because it's like of course the one day it rains and like I love rain but I don't want it to rain right now because I wanted to go shoot this so I guess we're probably gonna have to reschedule I'm gonna give it like 30 more minutes before I say something as of right now, it's at an 85% chance of rain. So that just can't happen. I'm surprised no one from the dealership was texting me saying like it's gonna rain, but I don't know. I mean, it's not the worst thing ever. Fall night at home cooking and stuff. It just like sucks because I like feel bad. You know what I mean? So anyways, I'm editing my um, anxiety like morning routine that I've been working on. I'm just doing the intro and that'll go up in the morning and I'm trying to get another video up right now but it just like won't finish processing which is so annoying. My videos have been taking so long to process lately. All right everyone, welcome to A Cooking with Kenzie. Tonight I'm making lentil soup with quinoa and mushrooms. Very exciting. As always, you're gonna start by cutting the onion, carrots, and celery. I don't know why I did that. Um, up and then it says that we're gonna put them in the pan for like 20 minutes which is a long time before adding everything else it honestly looks super easy but i'm excited All right guys, so we have the carrots, garlic, onion, celery, thyme. I also need to do some seasonings and do some olive oil and let it sit for like 20 minutes. You want the vegetables to soften. 20 minutes honestly is a pretty long time. So it says that you need to be patient, which is, you know, 
Not mine, not my best trait. left and I'm just getting really impatient um so we're gonna go ahead this is exactly what you're not supposed to do but it's literally two minutes it's fine we're gonna add in 10 cups of vegetable broth now that is a lot so you're gonna add in the lentils the quinoa and the mushrooms so here I am with the lentils it says in the recipe that it'll take about 15 or 35 minutes but on the bags, it says 15 to 20, so I'm just going to check in, and then you also want to add in the mushrooms, but that is what we have. Ooh, we've got all the lentils, quinoa, mushrooms. We're going to bring this back down to a simmer. Timer on for like 15 minutes. All right, guys, I just made myself a bowl of this soup. Um, it's kind of hot. As Liz is coming over, and I know, surprise, um, gosh, guys, it's just like so much food and it looks so good it smells so good like i cannot get over this if you guys actually replied and you said to put glaze on which like you know it's my favorite thing so i'll try it this is my new like such a weird thing to put on but this is truly my new if you guys have ever seen my big fat creek wedding where the dad thinks that swinex cures everything and solves everything which i kind of do too um glaze is like my equivalent definitely an odd thing but it's too hot right now but honestly the glaze with it i can tell is incredible and it smells so bomb i know people freeze their soup but that scares me like i don't want to freeze that ignore all the stuff on my counters this is what i'm going to use for tupperware seeing as how i don't have one big enough but this i just let the dogs on a walk it's raining out and fits is like the biggest diva in the rain but this tastes so good it smells incredible i would recommend putting the glaze on Thank you for those recs, guys. It was very good. Guys, confirmed by Liz, this is actually really incredible to add. It just, wow. I definitely noticed a difference. I just packaged, packaged them all up, put them all up. Um, the ones that I catch, like the lentils and quinoa, definitely got bigger. So, it is what it is. We still have, maybe I'll just hopefully eat the rest because I don't want to like throw it away. But, here we go. This is my, uh, my meal prep for the week, basically. We got our beautiful Sonic Blast drinks. Why am I doing this, guys? If you've seen the TikTok, see, isn't this a perfect size? The mini, no, it's not, not big enough. I could honestly do a medium. Okay, but, yeah. mini, personally, for me, is like the perfect size. Sonic Blast, you get the Oreo and cookie dough. It is so you good. You probably won't even finish this. I probably won't. Liz is just mad because I never finished my Blast. <laughs> like, literally so mad. Because I inhale it in like five minutes. I don't know why, it's just like really heavy for me, but it is so good. All right, guys, that is it for today's vlog. I definitely thought it was going to be a little bit more eventful, but I'm glad that we still did some meal prepping, some grocery shopping, all of that stuff. Hope you guys enjoyed. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you soon.